Hello, this is Jeffrey T. Bertiller. Welcome back to our YouTube channel, Service Management Leadership. This is our seventh video in a series on Request Fulfillment Best Practices, adapted from an article I read by Rodrigo Fernando Flores. And I want to talk about transparency. Isn't that a great word? And it has to do with the main frustration that most users have with IT is that they don't have the right expectation. They don't know what's going on and they don't know if they, they requested the right thing or when it'll be delivered. Does that sound true to you? So in this article, Mr. Flores suggests that people love UPS tracking. They love knowing when their stuff's going to be delivered. You know why? It's because it alleviates calls to the service desk, which saves you money. And so if we provide them tracking information or expectations, then it saves costly calls to our service desk. Most of you have metrics about how much each call costs to your service desk. And if we can alleviate 3%, 4%, 5% of those calls, that's huge, huge. And so I want to encourage you to put some kind of mechanism that allows status and expectation for these service requests. We want to provide visibility into all those processes. We want to use rich emails, not those HTML, ITSM platform generated ones, but we want to give them something tangible that we care and we know and we understand. And lastly, we want to provide them a receipt, not just a tracking number. This is, this is what you should expect when you get it, when you're going to accept, uh, expect it. And lastly, when it's delivered, give them a receipt with the ability to provide feedback on that process. All that together will muchly increase your customer satisfaction, which is great, but also lower your costs, which is even better. This is Jeffrey T. Fertiller. Thank you for joining us on our, on our YouTube channel. Please like or share this video. Subscribe to our channel. Leave me feedback below. I'd love to hear from you, and I hope you have a great, great day. Bye.